Hey, Summit, this is Edward. You know this guy, Jake. Weekly update coming at you right now. Share it on your platforms. Get the word out. Jake, we have four big things mm-hmm. coming up. Okay. Uh, spring is here. It doesn't necessarily feel like it, but I a little see- little chilly today. A little ch- <sighs> been chilly all week, but we do see some pollen falling outside, so that's a good thing, I, I think. I guess. Uh, green. I mean, it's not good for our sinuses, no. but at least things are growing, mm-hmm. and so it's good. This Sunday, we have a fundraiser going on that we want you to come be a part of. Baked potatoes. Baked potato. Now, all you guys are doing <clears throat> keto, and you're doing low yeah. carbs and that kind of stuff. Listen. Yeah, they can still make a donation. That's it. Just make that $100 donation. That's ten dollars. Oh, it's ten dollars for a baked potato salad and a dessert. You get to choose a topping. Can you give more? It's like a meat topping. Can you give or, more? You can buy as much as you want. Absolutely. So hey, yeah. I don't eat carbs. I don't eat potatoes. That kind of stuff. So mm-hmm. we're gonna make a donation to our preteens. But uh, my kids will be eating those. And all the so money goes to preteens. Preteen camp. Preteen kids getting camp. saved. Uh, it, it's it's good. Deal. So don't make lunch plans. Buy lunch here. It's it's to go. So you just grab it and go. Grab it and go to your house and eat. Grab it and go. Grab it and go. I have a small group that meets Sunday after church. We're going to buy those, and that'll be our meal for the day. And if you want to be a part of that small group, Come on and join us. We're, yeah, we're be still good. taking that'll new good. members. Hey, if you're watching this on Sunday, next Sunday is Easter. If you're watching this uh, before this Sunday, it's a week from Sunday. I think they figured that uh, out. Yeah. So, hey, Easter is coming up. It's going to be jam-packed. So let me let me give you a couple things. Jake's going to talk about something you can do this Sunday to invite people. Get there early. That's all I can tell you. Get there early. Yeah. Uh, Seats are going to be limited. And this is the first time in our history where I'm saying that. Uh, We're not doing two services. Uh, We're we're doing one service. We're maximizing that room. Communion is going to look a little bit different that Sunday. Uh, We won't have tables set up. There will be communion uh, in your chairs, each of those little individual communion deals. Make sure you get there early. Time out. Paula and I were talking. We are going to have communion that Sunday. It is going to look a little bit different. Uh, Paula and I were talking Sunday, a couple of different ways we can pull this off. Because uh, I actually had somebody tell me the other day, Crouch, that they went to a service one time where the communion was in the chairs and they sat on it. Wow. And the juice ruined their pants. Wow. So one of two things is going to happen Look on Easter Sunday. You you, we either going to have communion Look in your chairs you sat. or or our first impressions we'll team be will be handing them out. But... It's going to be awesome. But Easter not, Sunday is going to be that, awesome. That really, that really brings up a whole point. You really should look where you're sitting. Yeah. I mean, because when I was in school, we put stuff in people's chairs Whoopie on purpose. cushions. Tax. Yeah. Hey, spe- speaking of pranks, now this next thing that I'm going to be talking about. <laughs> yeah. Not sure about this. But yeah. yeah. No, it's good. It's We're good. not it's good. talking it's good. about when you were a teenager and you would do these types of shenanigans. Some of you would egg houses. Some of you at egg houses and TP trees and stuff. But what we're talking about is our children's ministry has come up with this really cool deal called You've Been Egged. And so this Sunday, this is a way to invite families to our Easter service. This Sunday, you're going to be able to pick up uh, a box of not real eggs. Grade A. Not real eggs. Grade A. And what you do is you go to somebody that you know, you hide the eggs in their yard, and then you put a door hanger on their door. That's good. And they can go look for the eggs in their yard, and then it's an invite to Summit Heights Fellowship for Easter services. It's a really cool thing to do. We'll have those available in the foyer this Sunday, so you can go out next week and egg people, egg people's houses, yards, and stuff. That's good. It just sounds so wrong. No, it does sound <laughs> yeah. wrong, but it is. It's a cool yeah. deal, and we have people every year that respond to this. And uh, hopefully, you've been praying about who you're going to invite uh, for for Easter. You don't have to egg their home necessarily, yeah. uh, but for children, this is such a cool deal, mm-hmm. especially for families that have children yeah. for them to come out. You're just hiding uh, little plastic Easter eggs it, in their cool. yard, it, and then you're cool putting deal. a door hanger on their door that invites them to church. You've yeah. been egged. Yeah, it's good. And then at the end of April, what do we have at the end of April? It's cool. End of April, we're doing a barbecue car show. It's a a teen fundraiser. Um, I understand this year this could be a blowout year for cars. 
Nice. Uh, they're talking 50, 60 cars probably, maybe, could be. I don't want to necessarily make that prediction, but yeah. that's what we're hearing. If you have a hot rod, a rat rod, or anything that you want to put in a motorcycle, four-wheel drive that you think uh, would be interesting in the car show, get with David, our youth pastor. And uh, it, there is a little fee to enter that, but there's yeah. also trophies and mm-hmm. uh, judges and all that good stuff. That uh, Freddie Ray Barbecue will be there. We'll have some hamburgers. Burgers on the side. Uh, it's going to be a. Cool I know y'all like those Sunday. I know y'all like those hot rods and stuff. But my favorite vehicles at these car shows are the old, like Ford Broncos or Chevy yeah. Blazers. Those old school, or even those old school trucks. For some reason, I really like those. Hey, this really answers to some of you have reached out to us about can we get together and have a fellowship as a as a church as yeah. a whole. Listen, this, this is a great opportunity mm-hmm. for everybody together, just like we do in the fall yep. uh, for the fall festival where everybody gathers outside. We're going to be gathering outside under the awning in the back. Uh, I think it's actually called church a family. porta We're going to be outside as a church family, hanging out, eating, seeing some really cool cars and hot rods and motorcycles and four-wheel drives and all that good stuff. So uh, it's going to be a good Sunday. Our youth ministry is putting this on as the fundraiser for camp. It's April 30th, the last Sunday of April. Spring is here, Jake. And then after April 30th on May the 2nd, it's my birthday. Happy birthday. In case I forget. Okay. Right now. Some of we love you. Hope you have a great week. Hope you have a great weekend. Uh, cannot wait to see you Sunday morning, 10 a.m. Don't forget, it's going to be a great Sunday. I cannot wait to see what God's going to do.